This new update on ROG Ally has definitely changed the game of PC handhelds, and this is the first iteration of the software. Let's see how well this is going to grow in the future. AMD Fluid Motion Frames AFMF, is now available on the ROG Ally, and in this tutorial, we'll walk you through the process of installing and using this feature. AFMF is designed to enhance your gaming experience by increasing frame rates and smoothing out movement. Before going in, let's understand what is AFMF and how is it going increase your FPS in games. AMD Fluid Motion Frames AFMF, is a frame generation technology designed to increase frame rates and smooth movement for enhanced gaming performance. It takes cutting-edge frame generation and integrates it directly into the AMD software driver, making it compatible with a wide range of DirectX 11 and 12 games. It can boost FPS by up to 97% at 1080p and 103% at 1440p resolution when combined with Fidelity FX Super Resolution 2 FSR2 at quality mode depending upon the hardware. It preserves image quality by dynamically disabling frame generation during fast visual motion. AFMF is not supported in all games, but it is compatible with a wide range of DirectX 11 and 12 games. Let's configure your ROG Ally for AFMF support. To get started, open the Armory Crate on your ROG Ally and navigate to the Content section. From there, go to the Update Center located in the bottom corner and click on Check for Updates. Once the system finishes checking for updates, click on the Update button next to the UWP App and Core Service option. Confirm the update by clicking Update Now, and the system will restart. After the restart, launch Armory Crate SE, which will reboot Armory Crate. To ensure that everything is up to date, open My Asus and go to System Update. Check for updates, and if there are any optional updates available, install them. Now, to enable AMD Fluid Motion Frames, open the AMD software. From the home page, go to the Gaming section in the middle, and then click on Graphics. Here you'll find the AMD Fluid Motion Frames option. Check it off, and it will automatically enable Radian Anti-AG as well. It's important to note that if you typically use the real-time monitor, it won't work with AMD Fluid Motion Frames at the moment. Instead, you'll need to enable AMD's Overlay. To do this, go to the Performance tab and click on Overlay on the side. Enable the Metrics Overlay and it will appear on your screen. To test if AMD Fluid Motion Frames is working, open a game. You should see a quick pop-up indicating that AMD Fluid Motion Frames is enabled. If you want to enable AFMF on a game-by-game -game basis, go back to the Gaming tab, click on Graphics, and turn off AMD Fluid Motion Frames and Anti-AG. Then, go to the Games section, select the game you want to enable AFMF for, for example, Call of Duty, scroll down to AMD Fluid Motion Frames, and check it off. Currently, this is the only way to enable or disable AFMF for specific games, as there is no widget available in the Command Center. That's all there is to it. By following these steps, you can now enjoy the benefits of AMD Fluid Motion Frames on your ROG Ally. However, you need to understand the limitations of AFMF too. AFMF may introduce additional latency to games, so it's recommended to enable AMD's Radeon Anti-Lag or Anti-Lag Plus feature to help reduce input lag. AFMF is not recommended for fast-paced competitive online games due to the added latency. AFMF has trouble handling UI elements in games and may cause artifacts and distortions, but this will improve with time as the technology grows. Currently, the FPS boost from AFMF can only be monitored using AMD's Adrenaline software overlay. Other monitoring programs will only report the base FPS. If you found this tutorial helpful, be sure to like and subscribe to our channel, and check out our other videos on the channel. We target to release a video every day. For more guides, tips, tricks, news, and game settings, keep it at Retro Pocket. Thanks for watching and have a great day.